Chapter 18 is all about writing, editing, and revising. Clues. So what are clues? The C in clues stands for coherence. And you've already watched a whole video about coherence, so I'm not going to um, belabor the subject. But coherence is extremely important, and it impacts everything in your writing. The language that you choose is very, very important. You need to be focused on those strong verbs that you've already done activities um, with in your book. Your word choice is key. Using academic language is important and keeping your tone, uh, matching your topic and appropriate to the topic is vital. Unity goes along with coherence. What's really important with unity though is that you not deviate from your topic. Ideas that you introduce need to be linked to and support the thesis. Emphasis. So what we mean by emphasis is how does your audience know which ideas are important to you or important to your point, right? How are you repeating them, emphasizing them, using um, that strong language to make your point? Emphasis is very important to keep your audience on the same page as you, with you, throughout your whole writing. Now support helps you build your credibility. Make sure your MLA documentation is done correctly. Back up your ideas. Use other sources. Don't just use a Google search. Uh, use those library sources I've already linked you to. And your sentences help um, make your point even stronger. It's using good sentence variety, uh, varying the beginnings and the endings of your sentences. So sometimes you begin with a a dependent clause and sometimes you might end with a dependent clause. Make sure you're using those complex compound and simple sentences in a variety of settings so that it's not exactly the same format each time. Nothing is more boring than reading exactly the same format of a sentence over and over and over throughout your essay. And always make sure you look check within your sentences for grammar.